ever world boxing champion. Hey, hey. Tragically, when he passed away, there was only a handful, handful of people attended his funeral. He was a forgotten, forgotten champion, a forgotten sportsman. So all I can say is, is to have all these people, all of you turn up, is a fitting tribute to, to my grandfather. I'm sure if he's looking down, he'll be proud. Just to let you know, especially if you live or you're from Poplar, is Teddy Baldock lived in number 32 Byron Street, which is literally a few hundred metres behind us. Right, and he attended uh, Langdon, well it wasn't the Langdon Park Community College then, but it was the uh, Hay Curry School. So he attended the school which we can see behind us, he lived only a few hundred metres away. He was immensely proud of Poplar, and he once said in an interview, Poplar's what made him, what made him the man he was. So anyway, I'd now like to introduce my mum, Teddy Baldock's only daughter. <laughs> Well, Colin works or a member of uh, Poplar Harker, and without them, this day wouldn't have happened. It's been a partnership between me and Pop uh, between myself and Poplar Harker. So thanks very much, Colin. <laughs> Just to finish off before we actually do the unveiling, when Teddy fought, he was known as the Pride of Poplar. Well, he's back here now. And, I'm hope that, and I hope that the people of Poplar can be proud of him again. So, Colin, yeah. First time I've done this, so I hope it will go smoothly. <laughs> 